Today we're going to compare a couple of power towers. So we're going to determine if 20 to the 2 to the 200 is bigger than or smaller than 2 to the 200 to the 20. And before we get started, I'd like to make the following observation about exponentiation. And this deals with perhaps what I would call the non-associativity of exponentiation. So when we write something like this, a to the b to the c, what we really mean is we're raising a to the power b to the c. So notice that that is not the same thing as ra raising a to the b power to the c power, which itself is equal to a to the b times c. Okay, so keeping that in mind, let's get started with our calculation. So I'm going to start over here on the left-hand side. So we've got 20 to the 2 to the 200. And I guess we should probably start with a guess. That'll help us, you know, do our inequalities. So my guess is that, in fact, this one on the left is larger. And that's because even though maybe it's got a smaller middle number right here, the number that influences the size of this type of object the most is the one maybe at the peak of the power tower. And there, the peak of the power tower is 200, which is obviously larger than 20 right here. Okay, so keeping that in mind, we might do something like this. We might replace 20 with 16 and push the inequality in the appropriate direction. So this is going to be bigger than 16 raised to the 2 to the 200. But now I can write 16 as 2 to the 4th power, which is now raised to 2 to the 200. But now I can take that 2 to the 4 and apply exponent rules, so multiply the exponents. That will give us 2 to the 4 times 2 to the 200. Great. And now we'd like to make this look like, let's see, something raised to the 20 power in our exponent. So we've gotten our base down to the right thing. Our base is now 2. Now we'd like to get the upper exponent equal to 20, if you will. Now, how am I going to do that? Well, let's start by writing this as 2 to the 4, or yeah, 2 to the 4 times 2 to the 10 raised to the 20 power. I think that'll do it. And then, well, 2 to the 10 is 1,024. So this is going to be equal to 2 to the 4 times 1,024 raised to the 20 power. But now let's observe that this 4 times 1,024 raised to the 20 is most definitely bigger than 200 raised to the 20. And, well, I think that's pretty clear. We don't really need to talk about that. So this whole thing is bigger than 2 to the power 200 raised to the 20. But that does it. That shows us that, yes, our guess was correct, and this one on the left was, in fact, the larger number.